What's up everybody? In this video, I'm gonna show you how to use Radeon DEX. Radeon is on Solana blockchain. So any coins that build on Solana blockchain or most of the coins can be found over here and you can swap them. So here's first thing we need to do before we can start swapping, we need to install or add wallet to our web browser. So once you press on connect, you'll see right here all of the supported wallets. For this video tutorial, I'm gonna be using Phantom. And if you are on mobile device, most likely you'll have to use Slope because I don't think they have Phantom for mobile device. So to download Phantom Wallet, we'll have to go to this website and I'll leave a link in the description below. And right here, we'll have to choose our web browser. They support four web browsers. I'm gonna choose Edge because that's what I'm using right now. And then add to Chrome and then add an extension. Okay, once it's done downloading, we'll be presented with the screen right here. We have to press on create new wallet or we can use secret recovery phrase. If for example, you already have one, you can use that seed phrase to recover or to use that same wallet. For this video tutorial, I'm gonna create a new wallet and this is gonna be my secret recovery phrase. Don't ever share with anybody. And for this video tutorial, I'm gonna blur this. I'm only gonna show you probably one phrase, but right here, total 12 phrase, which you'll have to do, you'll have to copy and paste it somewhere or save it. And then once you get that done, you can press, okay, I've saved it somewhere. And then we need to come up with the password. And then check mark and then press on continue and then continue one more time and then finish. And that's it. Now we can close this window. And right here on the top right corner, we have a little add-on extension and it says Phantom. Once you press on it, you'll see this little screen. And then right here, there's a deposit button, there's a send button. And then if you press right here, this is where you're gonna keep all your collectibles, for example, such as NFTs right here. This is a swap. You can actually use built-in into it if you like to, but I'm not sure if they're gonna have all the coins that you are looking for. And then if you press right here, recent activities, and then some settings right here. So let's say, for example, you went on a coin gecko or somewhere and you found some kind of coin, like for example, solid protocol. And then when you scroll down, you press on a market and then you saw that it's only tradable on radium. So you'll have to buy USDC that's on Solana network. And then that's what you will use to buy solid coins. But for this video tutorial, what I'm going to do, I'm going to just buy Ray coins. So first thing we need to do, we need to purchase some Solana. I'm going to open up new page. The easiest way to purchase Solana is to go to coinbase.com, register here, and then add your debit card. And then you can purchase cryptocurrency right from your bank. And I already made a purchase. I already purchased 26% of Solana. So what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna transfer the Solana to my Phantom wallet. So I'm gonna go back to my Edge browser. And then right here, I'm gonna press on Phantom wallet. And then in here, I'm gonna press on deposit. And then I just have to type Sol. And this is going to be Solana. This is what I'm going to be depositing. Press on it. And this is the wallet that I'm going to use to deposit Solana. So what I'm going to do, I'm just going to copy. And then I'm going to go back to my different browser where I have Coinbase pulled up. And I'm going to send Solana to that address. So right here, you will have to press on send and receive. And then send. And then in here, that's where we're going to paste our wallet address from Solana. And then I'm going to send that all. Solana. And then I'm going to press on continue and then send now. And then in here, press send now. And that's it. As you can see right here, it's sending Solana right now. And it says this transaction usually takes a few seconds. And now we can press on done. And if we go back to our web browser and then we'll pull up our Phantom wallet, we can see right now we already have $47 deposited into our wallet. That's how quick it is. So once we have money in our wallet, now we're going to go back to our radium swap. And then right here, we need to press on connect and then we need to choose Phantom. And then this window is going to appear. We need to press on connect here. And that's it. We successfully connected our Phantom wallet to Radian Dex exchange. So right here, what we need to do, we need to choose our currency, what we're going to be using to swap. So in my case, I'm going to press on Solana because that's what I have in my wallet. And actually, this is going to show me exactly what I have in my wallet. And then we need to select token, the one that we're going to swap this to. And then for this video tutorial, I'm going to buy Ray. And then right here, we can either put amount, 
how much we're going to use of Solana or we can press half or we can put max. So for this video tutorial, I'm just going to buy for 5%. So I'm going to press dot zero five. And then this is the information is going to give us slippage tolerance and then minimum receipt and then price impact. And then we just have to press on swap here and then press on approve here. That's it. Transaction being confirmed. And now if we go back to our phantom wallet, you'll see right here, we still have Solana 21% and then we have full token of radium. And this is pretty much it. Basically, if you need to swap any other tokens, you just go back and then you see and you'll have to find if the pair is with Solana or with something else. Same thing we can do. We can choose right here. We can type USDC. And then by USDC with Solana, let's say let's do 0.5 as well. And this is going to give us eight dollars of USDC. And then again on swap, same thing, approve. And the fees are a fraction of a pennies and that's it transaction has been confirmed and if we go back to our phantom wallet we'll see usdc appeared in our wallet as well and it's going to be very similar process if you're going to be using any other dexas on solana network also if for example you're going to decide to download mobile wallet you can download slope wallet and then you can use that same seed phrase from this wallet and you're going to be able to access the same wallet is just using different application as a slope. And this is pretty much it. If this video is helpful to you, press that like button and don't forget to subscribe. Thanks for watching.